oh hey i didn't have my mic on let's let's just screw up at the beginning of every live how's that that's great i did watermelons because it's summertime how are you tonight raven hello whoever else you are who else who else is that you hubby no somebody else oh now there's only two watching again Anyway, going to do that uh, 10 for 5 thing again. Good night. Because it worked out last time. Hello, hello. Whoever just came back in or in. Hello, hello. Say hello. Say hello. Hi, Avai. How are you? Hi, all. Hi, all two of us. <laughs> <laughs> Four. Okay, cool. Say hello when you come in so I know who else here, y'all. <laughs> we did, uh, uh, yeah, we did more we're mowing. <laughs> and yes, we're doing a sale tonight, same as last time. I'm good. I'm good, good, good. Doing all right. I hope everybody else is going doing well. Hi, Linda. How are you? What did everybody do this weekend? You know what Raven did? Raven went to the beach today. But I don't know what anybody else did for the weekend. My sister's here, uh, and things are cray, 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 crazy because she brought her two dogs and her parrot with her. So it's been kind of a lot, <laughs> uh, but we're, they're settling out a little bit. The two uh, larger dogs, my dog and her big Great Pyrenees um, are constantly chasing and playing and oh my god <laughs> I don't think I have her info but if you want you can send it to this email and then I can give it to Raven or you could send it to Raven at uh, Raven's uh, went Raven's treasure chest uh, 21, I think, at whatever. Wait, no. Just put your put your info in there, boo. <laughs> Hi, Linda. Of course we did. We always miss you. Linda, Linda. Well, slap your... Uh, your email in there for her, Raven, so she can send it again. There you go. I send an email with your info to that email that just came up in the chat. And if you haven't sent it to me, you can send it to my email too, which is on the screen. I don't remember writing it down, so I don't think I have it either. <laughs> Say hi to the queenie. Yeah, I don't punch her in the face enough. <laughs> Banana cream pie. I, if something you didn't know about me, hate bananas. I hate them. Hate, hate, hate. <laughs> if it was coconut custard, I'd be all over that, but. Yeah. Well, not anymore since I'm allergic to eggs. I can't have any of that bullshit. Which really, really sucks. But, you know, hi, Carol. How are you? Good to see ya. We got four in right now. I'm going to wait till we get like eight or nine in and then we'll start. 
you two what? That you're allergic to eggs or you like coconut custard or you hate bananas? Which one of those things? <laughs> I'm going to show everybody my, I was going to say pineapples, what the heck. They're not pineapples, they're freaking watermelon, freaking watermelons, dude. Oh, bleh. Yeah, no thanks. Horrible storms in the next hour, 70 to 80 mile per hour winds. Oh my God, Raven. I wish we'd have some, but not like that. Jeez, that's crazy. You're not going to have tornadoes, are you? Oh, okay. Yeah, me too. Me too, Linda. My three favorites are coconut custard, apple, and pumpkin. But I can no longer have the coconut. So that, that sucks. Alrighty, we got five in now. Share it out if you would. Uh, I have shared it to my group um, so far. Um, and we've got, I believe, Scooter Renee is live and so is Lydia. So we may have a smaller crowd. Yeah, pumpkin's good too. Oh, okay. I'll do that as soon as we're done here. Oh, tomatoes. <laughs> yeah, I'd rather have tomatoes than tornadoes. <laughs> Are you doing text to speech? That's hilarious. <laughs> we have seven now. Who else is here? Say hello so I know you're here. You don't have to say another word. I just want to know who you is. Yiz. Yins. Oh, you did it. You did it purposely. I thought it was text to speech. Because <laughs> that's something your text to speech would do. But yeah, that's a huge drop. We've been in the six, like, like high sixties for two days. It's weird. And it's supposed to be like just, just barely 80 tomorrow, which is, that's how I remember summer being when I was a kid. Not this 95 degree crap that starts like as soon as spring is over. Oh, God. Bleh. <laughs> now we're back down to four. All right. Well, I'm going to start. Um, since, uh, uh, everybody seems to be in, out, out in, any outie, the old any outie. <laughs> okay. Oh, I have a couple more bags that I had made that I put to, so, to the side, but I will get them when we run through these guys. I'm doing 10 items for $5. Each bag is a nice mix of things. This one has pink. I can't remember what this stone is called. But they're a uh, clip. And it's this Pepto-Bismol pink stone. And I can't remember what the stone is called. It's like a really strange color. And they're wired like they're wired on. And they get a little drop. So there's those. Hello, Patty. How are you? Okay. And then we have this mesh necklace with the big faux pearl. And this one has a little drop. Drop, but it's not named that. Okay. And then I have this Panther Link necklace panther link bracelet okay there's those just put a five in the chat or want if you want this bag 
This is a vintage one. Very cool. It's got these little, little leaves on it. It's really neat. It feels really cool, too. It's got like a vintage. It's got a fold over clasp on it. Right there. I hope everybody got their invoices. I've been doing invoices for two days because I let them backlog. This is Daisy Fuentes. And it's little rhinestones. It's a little circles bracelet. Where's my measuring device? There it is. Measuring device. And this is seven and a half inches. Hello. Miss Fun Surprises. I can't remember your name, hun. i I'm sorry. Oh, Cindy. Thank you, Patty. It, I'll, it'll stick. It, one of these days, it'll stick. And I'll remember who the heck you are. <laughs> Yep, we got 10 items for $5. Yes, it's a $5 bag. It surely is. And then we have this one. This was just untangled not five minutes ago. This one has some nice glass in it. These little square glass beads. And then I think these are enamel or... Uh, Lacquered wood in a turquoise color. That. And then we have this one. Little ring. And then we have... Ah, ah, this one with the three sparkly balls. Everybody likes sparkly balls, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, Patty would like this one. And then the last piece is this one on this faux faux leather. It's got a nice black pendant. Okay, that one is Patty's. Let's see. I'm running out of paper here. Patty Paul. All right. That one is sold. There you go. One. And then we'll do this one. Next. <laughs> of course. Doesn't everyone? This is a really cool... Uh, Scarf slide that is a, it's mother of pearl. Big shell, big shell one. Very cool. And you pull the scarf through this way. You put it through here and then through here. Very cute. That is number one. And we have this one that is a sheaf of wheat. Little brooch. And then we have this cuff that's very nice. Triple. It's a nice size, too. It fits up. Oh, Linda. Linda's in, and I haven't even showed everything yet. You want that tortoise, don't you? We have this. It goes in there with that. And we have this one. Very cool. I like it with the mesh over the beads. That's really neat looking. Okay. And then we have a long strand of faux pearl. Real long. And these are strung on uh, string. So they're uh, easily reused for something else. And then we have... A little, what do they call these? Starlight mints, I think. Cute little starlights. Hi, Elizabeth. Hi, everyone. So good to see everyone here. Yeah, we got ten people in. Or, okay, now we got nine in again. <laughs> Here's a little Hamsa. 
the red stone, reddish brown stone. Very nice. Next up is a very cute little choker with this is very antique looking with rhinestone. Nice, nice. And then when you get to the ends, there are no rhinestones from here to there. The centerpiece has rhinestone. They are not missing. They just aren't there. They're little knob. Hey, yeah, Mystic. How you doing? There's that. And then there's this big, long infinity chain. And that is yours. Linda, Linda Lou, all right, okay, let me put this stuff back in here for Linda. Do, do, do. I was in a rush tonight because I forgot to put my bags together. Good God, y'all. All right. This is number three. And these are your ten items. This one has a K on it, Elizabeth. <laughs> Rhinestones. Very nice bracelet. It's in great shape. We have that, and then we have some very nice faux pearls that are, they're knotted. I can't tell if there's a clasp. Hold on. No, these are straight over your head, infinity. They are long enough, I do believe, to go over your head. Good to see you, Mystic. Yeah, these are 22 inches long, so they'll definitely fit over your head. Then we have a little little pink swan ring. Very cute. Adorable. Announcement. What announcement do we have? New jewelry boxes for sale. Okay. Is that your announcement? <laughs> I might be talking to you about that. Ten pounds? I wouldn't turn that down. This is a cute little Christmas one. Look at that. Adorable. Okay. This is a very long station necklace. It looks to be vintage. It's got these little golden balls. Very cute. Oh, new sight. Uh, yeah, that's cool. You, you have to send it to me. Please. Send me the link, if you would, in my messenger. Because I did get... Oh, okay. It's just keeping you company there. All right, this is double hearts. Little stretchy. Is anyone interested in this guy for five yet? This one is marked. It says Darlene USA. It's a little patriotic uh, ribbon. Very cute. We have a smaller barrel clasp, faux pearl, and little Indian. This is Indian uh, paper mache, and it's got blue and green on one side and red and green on the other. Yeah, please do send me that link if you would, if that's okay. Or just send, send me a message with the name of it if you don't know how to do links yet. Alrighty, we have this beautiful little guy. I love the cut on these. 
even though they're plastic, I love that cut. I think they're neat. This one is very cute. Oh, oh everybody's going to get going to sell out before I can get to it because I'm doing my life. <laughs> All right. This one is uh, a triple. It's just got some resin on it, but they're cute colors. <laughs> Easy. All right. So nobody wants this one. We'll put that aside. There's that one. Oof. I think I'm allergic to something. My nose is itching. Oh my God. Hmm. Well, hang on a second. Oh, they're not, it's not finding the site when I type that in. Huh. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Huh. That is interesting. Do they not? Oh, they're mystery mystery boxes. Huh. Very interesting. Interesting. Okay, well, let's go back to what we were doing. All right, well, here's the next one of my boxes or bag. Anywho, this one is a remembrance of <clears throat> September 11th, never forget, pin. This is a piece of Petrified wood or agate or something. It's a really nice, makes a really nice brooch. Okay, and then we have this pretty little purple one with the toggle clasp and glass beads. Really pretty. And it has a hunk of stone on the end. I'm not sure what the hunk of stone is. Please let me know if you would like. Just put a five or a want in the chat. Hmm. 
if you would. This is a double strand. It's really cute. It's got a pearl strand and then it's got a little dot dash strand. Patty would like this one too. They have a little souvenir ring. They have a pair of gold tone earrings. I always count earrings as one, of course. This is a double strand of really nice faceted beads. Then we have a pair of tribal earrings. These are cool. I like the colors on those. They're very nice dangly posts and they still have their uh, backs on them. Very nice. Those were in my jewelry box for a while, Patty. Thank you. And then there's a little pair of, I think these are Swain. Wait, no, these are a different brand. Hold on. These are nice ones. These are mid-century uh, cufflinks. They're very heavy. And very brand new. Look at them. They're, they're just stunning. There's nothing wrong with them. There's no name. I'm very surprised. They're gorgeous. Very nice. Alrighty. Patty gets this one too. Thank you, Patty. Do, do, do. Here we go. Put them back in here. Oops. Oh, just dropped one. Ah. You're very welcome, Patty. Oh. I did drop one of your pieces on the floor, though. I have to crawl under here and get it. There we go. Eek. There you go. The little ring. All right. That's that one. Right over my dress. Hold on. Ooh. Okay. Next up, we have this one. That has a hematite necklace. This one has some stone in it. Very nice. This is a uh, faux freshwater, I think. Right or rice pearl? Yeah, yeah. Okay, there's those two. And then we have this very nice rose quartz strand. Not tiny chips. They're they're nice nice size chips. They're not the teeny tiny ones. And this one says courage to change. Patty would like that one as well. This is a piece of uh, mahogany obsidian, I do believe. You see the red in it. Then we have another little souvenir piece. Roadside stand, Arizona, 1960 what? That's where that's from, probably. Then I have this one, gold tone. On a snake chain. It's a New York and Company. This is a very nice uh, box, actually. And this is topaz color and uh, clear glass. Um, yeah, I figured that. These are beautiful glass beads. I think these rose quartz would look really pretty with the clear very nice. And then we have a double ring. One of these guys. And that is also Patty. Thank you again, Patty. That's a really nice bag. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 
There we go. Well, maybe I'll give it a try when I get done what I'm doing here, if I remember. This is my next one for my next trick. I have a beautiful tiger eye stretch. And then we have this little guy. It's like painted metal and rhinestone stretch. But each one, it's weird. It's like each one of these is a little, uh, oh, let's see. It's four. Oh, it's a double, like each one of these beads is like up and down like that. That's really cute too. And then we have a little star bracelet that is abalone with uh, colored resin over top. Very nice. Cute little guy. Here is a halo white ring with halo. Cute. This is one of those scribbly pins. Very vintage. Then we have this pretty black statement piece. Nice. We have the Aeropostale. Three colors of hoops. We have silver tone, rose gold, and gold tone. These retailed for 13 and uh, you're getting them for very low price. Very nice. Very, very nice. And this is uh, new old stock. It's never been, uh, never been worn. And then we have the little cross. Brushed steel. Cross bracelet. Cute. We have a little tiny ring that says Inspire on it. What's everybody doing? What's everybody do this weekend? I want to know. I want to know. Please tell me. Tell me. And this is a neat one. It's like a double, a double drop necklace. So no one is interested in this one. So we will put it away and put it aside. If you want it later, you can let me know. Whoop, Patty wants that one too. Okie dokie. <laughs> Patty making a killing, guys. And this will be in yeah, up and down. Oh, well, at least there was some up in there, right? Um. Yeah, Patty, I'm not going to invoice you for these until the first. Is that okay? Or if you would just like that the invoice now, let me know. Um, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that that does. That usually does help. Oof. Oof. All right. Have the next one. Uh, nutcase. Oh boy. That's always fun. This is a really cool knuckle ring. Uh, it is dark silver with tons of rhinestones. Do tell, Linda, do tell. Here is a big old brooch. Big ol' is my favorite unit of measurement. 
Big old brooch. There you go. Oh, wait. We need to put them in frame, don't we? There we go. And then we have this, which is on lovely cording. Pull this down to the front. There we go. We have this one. Nice. We have this one. Vintage uh, candle pin. All of the enamel is there. The paint, paint work is all there. Oh, I'm so sorry, Patty. That's terrible. We have that one. So that's four. And then we have five. Little Mermaid. She's adorable and brass. So that is five. Did I not put ten in here? Oh, I need to pick out two more things for this one. Two more things. That one and... Sure, why not? This one. Oh. <laughs> if I can get it out of here. There we go. Then we have this little beauty. Cute little necklace. And then we have a little leaf. Thick pin, very cute. The tie bar. Little rope design, very nice. It's for a, a you know, sizable tie. It's not one of those little teeny ones from the 40s. It, it would go nicely on a modern tie. There you go. We have this one that is strung on chain graduated gold tone yeah who was it there was somebody else the same situation it was a motorcycle accident and it was really recent and I can't remember who it was because well you know I'm old I can't remember stuff this one is a modern uh, trafari acrylic this is uh, steel, this pendant, but the rest of it is acrylic, I think. No, dyed halite. There's some dyed halite, and then the rest of it is acrylic, so it's made so that it's a little bit lighter. So that is our next 10 for 5, if anybody would like it. These two pieces are vintage and would definitely make your money back. And then some. So let me know later if you would like these. Uh, since no one is interested right this second. I've got several more bags to go. And I was planning on going for an hour, but I don't know if I have an hour's worth of bags, but we'll see. We will see. Because we've only got 20 minutes left. I think we'll be all right. Uh-uh. Okay, this one is not sold. Okay. Let's see. What else have we got? We got this one. Aw. Hugs, Mystic. That's sweet. That's sweet of you. Now this one is... It's one of these guys that clicks open like this. So you can get it on. Really cute. It's like got a big old knot right here. And then it is a uh, snake skin. So there's that one. 
Hello, whoever else has come in that I missed. This is a signed brooch, hand painted. I cannot read. Jody something. J O D I something. I can't read it. So that is an artisan piece, probably one of a kind. We have a little red pendant with Greek key around the outside, very cute. And that looks like it would fit on a larger, a much larger chain or beaded, a beaded piece. Um, you could definitely reuse that pendant on something else. This is an interesting painted brooch. It's painted purple. Different, very different. Okay, and then I have a steel bracelet. Very nice. Real heavy. Real nice. I'm wearing the other, I'm wearing the other steel bracelet. This is the only steel one that I'm keeping. <laughs> Patty would like that one for five. We'll go through the rest of it though. And you'll be getting these little dolphins. They're abalone with resin poured over to make the colors. We have a pair of puzzle piece earrings. <laughs> Nathan over there. I think these are for autism awareness. Or something. Patty paw. Patty paw. Patty paw. Alright, and then this. This is so rockabilly looking. I, I love it. Little fifties necklace with the polka dots, so cute. And then we have this one that is, I think this is the rose gold one. Yeah, it's a big old CZ on a chain, and it's brand new from Arrow. Still on the card, very nice. Okay. So this one is also Patty's. Thank you, Patty. Sweet. She is cleaning up tonight, guys. There you go. Hello to everyone. Um, 11 of you watching. 10, wa 10 watching. Somebody left. If you wouldn't mind, could you please uh, hit the hit that like button. It helps me a lot. It talks to the algorithm and tells it that I'm important. <laughs> um. And share me out if you would, because I'm still, I'm only a little bit past halfway to a thousand. And as soon as I hit a thousand, I am monetized. I can get monetized. So that'll be cool. I'm not in a huge rush, but, you know, every little bit helps. If you could share it. This is beautiful. It looks like a J. Crew to me, but there's no, there's no name on it, but it's a really nice piece. Got these big rhinestone-y looking ones. Very pretty. Pretty, pretty. And it's got a nice weight to it as well. Mm -hmm. And we have this big pyramid ring. Beautiful. God, just look at that thing. That's crazy. Crazy. That. We have a piece of picture jasper, a little pin. Very nice. Yeah, I've been kind of stuck at 500 for a really long time. It takes a while. Like, it took me a couple of years to even get to 200. So, I feel you. This, if you wanted to wrap it, you could just pry off the glue. And wrap it and make a nice pendant. You could do that. 
that's three. And then we have this guy. Black and silver tone. Nice clasp. And then we have these awesome cufflinks. They remind me of Beetlejuice. <laughs> these are modern. These are very modern ones. They're really cool. I like them. All right, so what we got? One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. Wait, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, we do have five more. Okay, we have a little Santa Claus. He's enamel. He's adorable. Yeah, it takes a while to get. This is beautiful, this little porcelain brooch. This is very much a vintage piece. Little tiny thing. Let me see if it's uh, painted or transferred. That looks like it's fired into the glaze, so that's cool. Very nice. We have a little pair of gray metal earrings. <laughs> and then we have two tiny little pairs of earrings. Hold on. I'm counting this as one. It's a little tiny hoop and a little tiny faux lapis. So those. And last but certainly not least, we have a Betsy Johnson. Betsy Johnson. And it's got, you know, hearts and and her leopard. And it's got the cute little bow. Of course, she always puts the bow on there. And then we have a little froggy. And some more hearts and leaves. Little tiny leaves. That's a cute one. Let me know if you would like that one. For 10. Let's put that back in the bag. All right. Oh, that's sweet. <laughs> there we go. This one is not going anywhere. Nobody's interested. And we have 10 minutes. And this is the last bag that we are going to do. And then we are done. We have a big old brass and black glass. Uh, it's on a, oh, what do you call it? Memory wire. One. That's one. Mother of Pearl and Tiger Eye. Little necklace. And then a little vintage silver tone. Laser cut. Leaf brooch. Very cute. There you go. And then there's two pairs of blue. Earring. Uh, two different kinds of hooks. Okay, we have these that are double. Double drops. And then these are little cobalt glass ones. These I made. And they are, this is the, um, the hooks are sterling. Very nice. Those are nice. Nice, nice. This one is reasonably long. It's got some nice detail. Several strands of chain and some, we call it, uh, uh, station. Cute. Beautiful pearl with an antique clasp. It looks like, oh, look at that clasp. That's really nice. These are not 
Ooh, wait a minute. Can I see you? I don't think so. All right, there we go. Nope. Oh, that's sweet. Thank you, Linda. Thank you, everyone. And then we have the pearls. These are really nice little pearls. Um, this one is a little rose gold with a little one of these little rhinestone -y balls. I love these things. Very pretty. And then we have a, a crisscross ring. That I got as a prize from a, a giveaway that Texas Gal Treasures was doing a long time ago. So that's brand new, never been worn. And then last but not least, we have this vintage guy that is blonde wood and uh, white. And it's reason it's a good long one. Good long thing. There you go. So that is the last one. Okay, there you go. Oh, I'm sorry, Marianne. I'm getting ready to be done here. We're done. Girl, you showed up late. I got another nine minutes, but I'm out of bags. Let me uh look around and see if I have any more stuff I can put in a bag. Patty got this one. Patty got this one. I know. What the heck, woman? You know I go on at 11. <laughs> you silly. I... <laughs> do, 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 do. Okay. One, you forgot. Yeah, I know how it is. Well, you know, I'll be back tomorrow at three p.m. If you if you can swing that one. <laughs> night night, Linda. Okay, that one goes to Patty. Let's see, what have I got that I can show you next? I don't really have anything picked out. So how about we'll do 10 rings for 5 bucks for this last bag, okay? This one, but not the one I'm wearing. No, you can't. No, no. So this one's got a ring stuck inside it. <laughs> okay. This one, the little white stone. And then, how about little peace sign, a little sterling and uh, turquoise, that's three. And then we have this little guy, four, five, oh, look at the pretty little green clotta, so cute, six, Seven, I think this one's sterling too, but don't quote me on that. All right, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Pretty tiger eye. Eight. Nine, charoite and copper. And ten, we have silver plated and 
Malachite. So that's 10 rings for $5, guys. And they're all in good shape. And that is going to do it for my evening tonight. I want to thank everybody for being here. Put these away since nobody's interested. Eee! Put them back in the bag they were in, I guess. Play with them later, I guess. All right. Yes, indeed. Let's put this ring back on. I would like to thank you all for being here. I'll be back tomorrow at 3. Big moon ring. What are you talking about? Huh? Moon ring? Moonstone? I don't think I have a big moonstone ring. You must be thinking about somebody else. I have a couple little ones, but I don't have a big one. I think, um... I think Jen has a big one, and Moonstone Mamas has a big one, too. <laughs> All righty. Remember that I love you. And if you're free tomorrow at 3 p.m. Eastern, uh, come and stop by. Remember uh, to be yourself because everyone else is... Taken. That one is taken. <laughs> Love you guys. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Thank you so much, Patty. Thank you, everyone.